Something has changed about the OSD tab in Betaflight 4.2, and it is making a problem for folks when they try to upload a new font to their flight controller. Let me plug this guy in here. I'll show you what I mean. So here in the OSD tab, we've got the font manager, and we can actually upload fonts. We can change the, the font that's used in the OSD, and you can upload a custom image. You can make a custom splash screen that'll show up on your screen when you arm the quad or when you plug in. And that's all well and good, but most people who are trying to upload a new font are trying to fix the problem where you have a screen full of Vs. A screen full of Vs means that your font got corrupted and the way to fix it is to upload the new font. But watch what happens here when I try and upload font on this flight controller. Nothing happens. Now, in the past, I would have said that the problem is that you have to plug a battery in in order to upload the font. And that is true, and that's always been true. But I'm going to tell you, I tried that, and it still didn't work. And that is the focus of this video. Now, I just unplugged my flight controller from USB because the change that Betaflight 4.2 made is that at the moment that you plug in the flight controller, it tries to detect whether there is an OSD chip present. And if the OSD chip is not present, then it permanently disables the OSD uh, forever. Joshua from the future here. Uh, if by forever you mean until the next time you power cycle the flight controller, yeah, it disables the OSD forever. It doesn't disable it forever. Please don't freak out and think that you're going to somehow permanently, literally permanently break your OSD. It just turns it off until you power cycle it. So in order to make this work, then what you need to do is first plug in a battery. And now the OSD chip is powered up. You see, not all flight controllers power up the OSD chip from USB. And so if you plug in USB, the flight controller goes, oh, I guess I don't have an OSD, and it disables the chip. Now that the OSD chip is powered up, I can now plug in USB, go to the font manager, select my custom image, and upload the font and it works. If you are trying to upload fonts in Betaflight 4.2 and either the upload font button is grayed out, or when you go to upload font, nothing happens. Plug in an XT60, then plug in USB, and then it will work. By the way, the re why do they do that? The reason is that some of these new flight controllers that are made for the DJI system don't have an OSD chip on board. And if Betaflight expects there to be an OSD chip and tries to talk to the OSD chip and the chip isn't there, then uh, it, can, it causes problems problems, the PID loop gets, anyway, causes problems. So Betaflight added this check for these new flight controllers that don't have the OSD chip. So in, in the end, all of this inconvenience is DJI's fault, just like you knew it would be. Happy flying, everybody.